Firefighters battling this fire that they say spread from a homeless encampment to a business park in Highland Park. KCAL's Joy Benedict is live now in Highland Park with the details. And Joy, you actually have some hard numbers saying these fires that begin in homeless camps are on the rise. Yeah, that's exactly what the Los Angeles Fire Department is telling us, that the calls they're receiving because of people experiencing homelessness are going up. And it's hard to see any business go up in flames, but when neighbors say they think it could be present for preventable, it makes it even more difficult. Talk about how hot these flames were. It completely melted this parking meter and, of course, gutted what was inside. Cell phones were rolling as flames on Figueroa turned to business. To ash. It looked like it was completely gutted on the inside. Those passing by this Highland Park business hours later could still smell the smoke as water dripped from the awning. And if you look through the glass windows that didn't break, the damage was clear. A missing roof and what was once a furniture restoration business had little left. It's obviously concerning, especially if it was related to a homeless encampment. And that's exactly what investigators say happened. A homeless encampment outside caused the fire inside. And although the owner of the business was too upset to talk on camera, they say much was lost. Neighbors say the homeless encampments aren't hard to find. There's certainly a number of homeless in the in the neighborhood. I think that's kind of a citywide problem. And the fire department says it is. As LAFD Fire Chief Chris and Crawley told us a couple of months ago that 50% of all fires in the city are caused by people experiencing homelessness and their call volume has soared. Individuals who are unhoused, it's about an 12 and a half percent increase just overall in call volume. That is with EMS as well as fire related calls just across the board. Despite the fire, those living nearby say it is getting better. I do think that some of the tiny homes that were erected in our district especially uh, have been ameliorating that problem. It's gotten a tremendous amount better. Um, you know, there is tons of little tiny houses further down the street, um, so people have options. But, you know, more mental health is basically what's needed. Help that would come too late for this business, as those who live here hope this incident sparks the attention of the city, so change isn't too far away. Oh, it's unfortunate. Now, this fire started early this morning. It took about 75 firefighters, about 40 minutes to put it out. Thankfully, it didn't spread to any of these other businesses here on the street. Again, they are saying it was started by a homeless encampment, but what sparked that first flame? That is still under investigation. I'll send it back to you guys. All right. Thanks so much, Joy. And still ahead, a 